The European Central Bank must tighten monetary policy if it needs to counter inflationary pressures and cannot be put off from doing so by the financing costs of Eurozone states, ECB policymaker Jens Weidmann told the Welt am Sonntag newspaper. Eurozone countries have ramped up their borrowing to cope with the coronavirus pandemic, potentially leaving them exposed to increased debt servicing costs if the central bank tightens policy to counter upward pressure on prices. The ECB said the ECB is not there to take care of the solvency protection of the states. And Weidmann said that, of course, whose role as president of Germany's Bundesbank gives him a seat on the ECB's policymaking governing council. Should the inflation outlook rise sustainably, the ECB would have to act in line with its price stability objective, Weidmann said. And he said, we have to make it clear again and again that we will tighten monetary policy if the price outlook calls for it. We cannot then take into account the financing costs of the states, he added. After its uh, July 22nd policy meeting, the ECB pledged to keep interest rates at record lows for even longer to boost sluggish inflation and warned that the rapidly spreading Delta variant of the coronavirus posed a risk to the Eurozone's recovery. I do not rule out higher inflation rates, the paper quoted Weidmann is saying. And he said, in any case, I will insist on keeping a close eye on the risk of an excessively high inflation rate and not only on the risk of an excessively low inflation rate. The eurozone economy grew faster than expected in the second quarter, pulling out of a pandemic-induced recession, while the easing of coronavirus curbs also helped inflation shoot past the ECB's 2% target in July, hitting 2.2%, but that's far below the UK. When the ECB decides it's time to tighten policy, Weidmann expected the central bank would first end its PEPP emergency bond purchase program before scaling back its APP purchase plan. He said the sequence would then be first we end the PEPP, then APP is scaled back and then we can raise interest rates. And I'll see you in my next video. Bis gleich.